Glad you're with us tonight. Should be a good game before it's all said and done. Hardaway on the point, challenged by Peyton. Near side is Hardaway, crossover left to right hand, dribbles. That was where Ricky didn't think he was going to be when he made that drive. 8.44 to go in the first period. 9-5 to five is the score. The Warriors lead by four. Hardaway tosses one over to Mario Eli. Eli one on one. Double team. Got rid of the ball, but right to Bernard Benjamin. Hands out to Pierce. Three on two. Over to Kip. Right by Hardaway to the glass. Lays it up. And Lester tampered with it on the two. Their largest lead. Hardaway four court right covered by Peyton. Sneaking up on him, Gary Payton on Hardaway. Hardaway inside looking for Owen. It's one of my kids not open. Hardaway now works to the left hand side of the key. Marcelona popped out to get it. Five on the shot clock. Double team jammed up over to Owens. Over the ring, the jumper away. Missed it. Pierce side. Seattle by four. Owens darts away from Kemp. Spins in. Double team outside of Marcelona. Marcelona's working on the key. Fires one over to Hardaway. Coming over the top. Gary Payton whistle with a foul. Hardaway beyond the three point line. Up on him is Payton. Payton challenges Hardaway. Double team. Over to Lister. Out of the corner. He'll take the long jumper. It rolls in and out. Warriors by six. Owens out on the point. On top it comes to Lister. Al Tone. Now to Billy Owens. Owens in the key. Kemp waiting for him. Owens will fling one up. Out is McMillan. It is Peyton, Johnson, Cage, and Kemp on the floor for Seattle. Warriors will bring it up. Gary Payton denies hard away. The ball of the inbound pass. Owens will bring it across midcourt. Billy Owens covered outside by Kemp. Hands off to Hardaway. Deflected by Payton. Off the leg of Hardaway. Goes back in the backcourt to get it. 12 on the shot clock. Here comes Hardaway, bobbing, weaving outside, skips it to Owens, turns, wheels it over to Mullen, down to Lister, juggle the ball, out of bounds. Lister. Well, on this uh, play here, Hardaway on that drive, and Peyton uh, kept him from going to the basket. He backs away and bounces one off the rim. He has really been off very, very badly at times tonight. And playing with a sore lower back. Dennis Rodman, very quiet, game five in Seattle. Michael Jordan. Percy Hawkins. Percy Hawkins, as Michael Jordan described, has been very scrappy, very aggressive. He's played very well the last two games. Jordan lost. Sean Kemp just stays with it. Sean Kemp again, very active. The difference for Chicago, they're taking the ball to the basket. They're not settling for the perimeter game. Yeah, that's what Jordan attempts to do and was fouled. He was hacked. Percy Hawkins called by Chicago on the road. And he had to chase Gary Payton around at the uh, at the other end of the floor. Off the steal. And taken back by Payton. Payton for Kemp. 40 remaining in this opening quarter. Marv Allen with Matt Dukas and Bill Walton. Marv Rashad had a score working the sidelines. Payton. Yes. And the, and the game is tied at 12. Bulls have hit their first two three-point attempts. Jordan and now Pippen. Scotty Pippen who's playing hurt the bad ankles and bad back, sore knee, has had a very difficult series. Has a shot for only from way out. The tip has Two coach to pull the trigger. I pass it to Jordan instead. Excellent call. <laughs> Shot clock at five. And a travel is called. Oh, they were trying, but Michael Jordan really played beautifully by Gary Payton. Bumping from behind, getting around and fronting, and doing a terrific job as he has now the last two and a half games. Just unable to get the ball to him. And Michael Jordan celebrating on their floor. Won the last two in Seattle. And now the Bulls are hoping. The last couple of trips, they have to start handling the ball much, much better. Already 11 turnovers tonight. They had just 11 for the entire game on Friday. Nice ball movement. Pippen slicing his way, trying to feed off the long way, but it was called for a charging foul. Hawkins been very quiet here tonight after the two solid games. Look out. That's headed on the way. Brown trying to save it. Jeff Shawnee plants it. Most lead by one. Garnett will get it. Faces up on Vinny. What a ball fake. Jazz right goes left into the lane. Lost to handle. Zerbiak comes up with a cross court intercepted by Payton. Zips it ahead to Lewis. He'll sprint to the glass and lay it up and in. That was a sensational stop by Seattle. Now Zerbiak with the inbound. Throws it away in backcourt. 
Patterson's got it. Ahead to Peyton. Has chance. He's got three. He's got two and one. The Wayne Wade also told me off camera, he said, you know what? Shaq wants another ring. Plain and simple. He will let you know about the three rings he already had. On that half reverse, he plays the glass as well as anyone I've seen in years from that angle. That's difficult. He is playing on a special level right now. Right back to Prince. Morning. He was looking elsewhere, but 35. Phillips looking to find some room. Hunter looks up at the shot yeah. Good switch by Gary Pate. Hunter for three. Davis had it, lost it. Dive on the floor, still a scramble. Hunter, meaning that he's out on the floor with minutes, but no ball catches. Hamilton, quick catch and shoot. And Posey, who's played another side. This is what he does. He's the extra guy. He's not involved in all your main action. But on the baseline, he is so dangerous at that mid area from the rim to the sideline. Rasheed Wallace can't connect. O'Neal fighting for the rebound, but Hamilton comes away. Prince kept it alive. Phillips feed to Ben Wallace. Out of bounds. Last touch by Detroit. Now midway point of the fourth quarter. On his three-minute spell here, this group out on the floor for Miami has done an excellent job defensively. Phillips on the drive. Nice pull-up, Chauncey Phillips. He talks about winning a championship. Well, my guys, Posey and uh, Jason Williams, who played for me in Memphis, both just say he's the hardest-working guy we have here, and he puts... A three-pointer for Brent Berry at the horn. Here's a steal by the old vet. Peyton comes away with a basketball. And Seattle may have weathered the storm. Five minutes left to play. Eight-point lead. There's Lewis up off the glass for two. It's been Richard Lewis and Laz Burrell, the youngsters, showing the way for the veterans. And Seattle has forced Houston into calling a timeout. That was a block shot by Gary Payton. And Payton takes it in.